started up my ASMR and NFL Picks family and Fragrance family and Cookie family. Y'all know it is your boy, your whispering perfume pimp, Christopher Cologne. So I'm back with another video. I just wanted to see what this black light would look like. It's only one of those ones that I ordered that I unboxed a few weeks ago. Um, it's only one. I just wanted to see what it would look like on camera and everything. But y'all think y'all think I need to do it? I should do a whole video like this, especially considering if I get Leslie to do the right makeup and everything, it'll make a good Halloween video. So I think I'm going to do my dead cologne dealer in this. So, but yeah, I'm getting ready to switch the light on and everything like that. And, Cut this off and we're gonna get into the NFL picks video. Okay, y'all, so I got the light back on. Yeah, I just got off of work and everything, so it's Wednesday night, Wednesday, October 16th. Well, it's October 17th now, so Thursday morning. Wednesday night, Thursday morning. I got my sleepy time tea, which is has valerian root, spearmint, and chamomile things that are good to calm the nerves and everything because like I have not been doing good lately I've not been feeling great at all lately so but we're not going to get into that we're getting ready to get into this the picks for week six I think I only missed two games and I got really close to that Jets and calling that Jets and Bills game right so, and now, now Aaron Rodgers has Devontae Adams, so, which they used to play together in Green Bay. Yeah, so it's getting really get interesting. And Josh Allen, he has Amari Cooper, so, you know, the Jets could make a turnaround, and then those two teams end up battling it out for that for the AFC cuz I don't think it's going to be the Dolphins and the uh I don't think it's going to be the Dolphins and the um and the Bills. I think it'll be the Bills and the Jets. So Okay. I can't believe we're already in the week seven of the NFL. This is my favorite time of year, football season, you know. So the end of summer to the beginning of the year is it winter time. I mean, that's my favorite time. And it goes by, the, it seems like this time of year goes by faster than any other time of the year. So, okay. So we have, we have the 49ers at the Seahawks. That was a game that I thought was going to be interesting, which I didn't even get to watch any this week. I wanted to watch this year, but I'm not getting to. So, but the 49ers won 36-24. So I did get that one right. We got the Jaguars at the Bears. I picked the Bears to win, and they beat the Jaguars 35-16. to So... I got that one right. And have, have y'all seen the uh, Jacksonville approved of, what was it, $1.4 billion new state-of-the-art stadium for for Jacksonville? And it's like, come on, man. Y'all can't, y'all, y'all's football team ain't worth a damn. Y'all can't do shit, and y'all are, but y'all got that stadium. The stadium is better than the damn team. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, which that'll bring, there. there's a lot of controversy around uh, stadiums and, you know, tax dollars getting used for the stadiums. But they also, but a stadium and a stadium being in a city also helps create revenue and all that. So there's a, there's a lot to it, but personally, I wouldn't, I wouldn't want my tax dollars going to it, but that's just me, and there's many reasons for it, but y'all learn how I feel about government one day, if you haven't already, so, but we got the Bucks at the Saints, and that 
was a game that I said was going to be interesting. It didn't look like that game went as interestingly as I thought it was going to. But the Bucks beat them 51-27. to So I got that one right. Then we got the Commanders at the Ravens. And the Ravens beat the Commanders 30-23. to I mean, the Ravens beat the Commanders 30-23. Hold on, did I say that right the first time? Anyway, I'm tired. But, uh, yeah, it looks like that was more of an interesting game than the Saints than the Saints and Bucks. So, and then we had the Cardinals at the Packers, and the Packers beat the Cardinals 34-13. And I picked the Packers to win. So, there was that. Then we had the Colts at the Titans, and I picked that to be an interesting game. And the Colts beat the Titans 20-17. to And I did get that one right. Then we had the Texans at the Patriots. And I picked the Texans to beat the Patriots. And they beat them 41-21. to You know, and I thought the Patriots were actually going to do a little better than they're doing. It doesn't look like the teams are going to turn around anytime soon. So then we have the Browns and the Eagles. The Browns and the Eagles. And, uh... I picked the Eagles to win, and the Eagles did win 20-16. to Then we have the Chargers at the Broncos, and I picked the Broncos to win, and the Chargers won 23-16. So that was the first one I got wrong. Then we have the Steelers at the Raiders. The Steelers at the Raiders, and I picked the Steelers to win, and they did win 32-13. And I wonder what Tom Brady, now that Tom Brady is officially, you know, uh, one of the mem- one of the owners of that team, I wonder what he's going to think about that team not doing shit, you know. So, Falcons at Panthers. Falcons at Panthers. I picked the Falcons win and they did win 38-20. So I got that one right too. Then the Lions at the Cowboys, and I picked the Lions to win. And the Lions beat the shit out of the Cowboys, 47 to nine. They walked all over them. So I got that one right. And I picked that to be an interesting game. And you know, if you're a Lions fan, that was definitely interesting. And uh, well, I guess in ways you could say, if you were a Cowboys fan, that was that was interesting. Maybe not in a positive way, but. And that can be looked at as like, well, what the fuck is going on here? This is, this is pretty interesting. Let me let me look into that. But um, I went the Bengals at the Giants, and I picked the Bengals to win. And the Bengals did win, seventeen to seven. So I got that one right. And the Bills and the Jets, and I picked the Jets to win, but the Bills won twenty three to twenty, which I think the next game Jets got their ass. Uh, or have they already played? I don't. I don't think they have. So, but I got that one wrong. So I'm um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So twelve and two for the week. Twelve and two. Okay. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna get this. We're gonna get the camera switched around and we're gonna make picks. Okay, well, so we are in week seven, seven, and we got the Broncos at the Saints.
Seahawks at Falcons, Texans at Packers. That should be a good one. I won't make that an interesting game. So those are the two games that I'm actually interested in so far. Bengals at the Browns. get their running back back this week. So then the Eagles at the Giants. And then we have the Raiders at the Rams. Panthers at the Commanders. That's the Sunday night game, and then, oh, oh no, it's not the Sunday night game. I'm surprised that's not the Sunday night game. The Jets at the Steelers is the Sunday night game, but the Super Bowl rematch is not. That doesn't make sense to me. So the Jets at the Steelers. Ravens at the Bucks. Now I got the Chargers at the Cardinals. Okay. So Broncos at the Saints. I'm going with the Saints. Then we got the Pats at the Jaguars. Um, I don't even know who to pick on that. The Lions at the Vikings, that's going to be a good game. And that game could go either way, but I'm picking the Lions. I think the Lions have, have an edge on them. Lions have a better quarterback, I think. So, uh, and I think they're just a slightly better team. So then we got the Titans at the Bills. I'm going with the Bills. Then we have the Dolphins at the Colts. I'm gonna go with I'm gonna go with the Colts. Seahawks at the Falcons. Oh the Falcons whoa. What the Falcons do last week? Falcons at the Panthers beat them 30, 38 to 20. Had the Falcons beat the week before, or did they lose the week before? Oh shit. Um, I'm gonna pick the Falcons just because they're at home. And then we have the Texans at the Packers. That's gonna be a good game. But I think the Texans will pull that one off. I think that'll be a close game. Then we have the Bengals at the Browns. And the Bengals have been struggling so bad this year. So for the Browns. But I'm going to go ahead and go with the Bengals. Um, then we have the Eagles at the Giants. I'm going with the Eagles. Then we have the Raiders at the Rams. I'm going with the Rams. Panthers at the Commanders. I'm going with the Commanders. Chiefs at the 49ers. Um, I don't know. Then we got the Jets at the Steelers. I think the Jets will take that one. And then we have the Ravens at the Bucks. I'm going to go for even though the Bucks have been playing good, I think the Ravens got the upper hand on them. So I'm going with the Ravens. And then we got the Chargers at the Cardinals. The Chargers at the Cardinals. And I'm just going to go with the Cardinals because I can think, I think that could go either way. But the Chiefs at the 49ers. Um, I'm just going to go with 49ers. So, okay. And then the bat, the bag, the bats at the Jaguars. Um, I don't know. I'm just picking the Jaguars. 
So, yeah. So, yeah. So, who we have is the Broncos at the Saints. Well, I have the Saints over the Broncos. The Jaguars over the Pats. The Lions over the Vikings. The Bills over the Titans. The Colts over the Dolphins. The Falcons over the Seahawks. The Texans over the Packers. The Bengals over the Browns. The Eagles over the Giants. The Rams over the Raiders. Commanders over the Panthers. 49ers over the Chiefs. Jets over the Steelers. Ravens over the Bucks. And the Cardinals over the Chargers. And my most interesting games... I think are going to be the Lions at the Vikings, the Texans at the Packers, the Chiefs at the 49ers, the Jets at the Steelers, and Bengals at Browns, considering both those teams are struggling, that'd be, that'd be interesting to see if either one of them do anything, but I'm going to go with the Ravens at the Bucks for my fifth one. Yeah, so that's what I have for this week, y'all, for the NFL. Shit, that's what I have this week, y'all, for the NFL picks. I don't know what the hell my stomach was thinking, but... But yeah, oh, and as far as this... Yeah, if you like honey, get you some get you some of the sleepy time tea. And you know, go ahead and brew up some and put some honey in it to sweeten it a little bit. Tastes pretty good. And it fucking it helps too. I ain't gonna say it helps everybody because everybody's different, but yeah. So I'm going to get off here and go to bed and get up and edit this and everything. So, I don't know why I feel like I'm forgetting something. I don't know. But anyway, so I'm going to get off here, y'all. Y'all take it easy. I'll see y'all next video.